the talented, the wonderful Mr. Jeff Sewell. I did all that, and may I say, not in a shy way. When I um, left the meet, she was a bit of a shock. What has he got? People thought I was giving up the music industry and giving up singing. No way. I love singing. I love doing what I do. It just took me a lot longer to get to this point, but now that I'm here and, and I want to continue this journey. Indeed it must. Since Amici, I've now uh, had a chance to do a solo album, and that solo album is going to be released uh, on Mother's Day, and the first country in the world it's going to be released is New Zealand. The feel of the album is inspirational, it's warm, it's vibrant, it's fun. Um, it's just a collection of the songs that have inspired me on my journey so far. So the song selection was a, a long process. Essentially though, it's the songs that I absolutely adore. Uh, songs that uh, mean something to me, mean something to the family. I've now got two little girls and a wonderful wife. Uh, songs that I've grown up with. Having the best producer in the world, you know, Nick Patrick is an incredible man. Uh, the A-team, engineers, just having the best people around me is, is a great thing. Well, when I first met Jeff, he was in a group, Amici, and even then he had a, a real standout quality about his voice. It's the ability to go from beautiful, soft, tender pop singing to transform into really authentic classical. And it's, it's a very impressive thing, that, and something very rare, and that makes him really very special. The decision to leave Amici was essentially because of the family. Our oldest daughter was uh, was not well, and so we decided we've got to get rid of some of the stuff in our lives that uh, are not conducive to making her well. And uh, it's Operation Siena for, for us for the last year and a half, and will continue to be so. Our heads are in a far 
better place than we were a year and a half ago as well and just continue to, to have a, an amazing journey with our family. your fear and believe um, and I think everyone knows you know who have, are going through an experience like that or have had news like that or, or you know you just do anything for your kids Sounding great, Jeff. You know what we could do? Let's go one more from the top and keep it for that really nice intimate vibe at the beginning, and then just let it just let it build a little bit when the rhythm track comes in. We did the first two albums with Amici through Nick, and Nick and I just got on really well. You know, he's a great, great guy who um, we have a kind of similar similar spirit, sort of a go-get him attitude, and let's let's get this right. Let's let's um, you know create an atmosphere that is conducive to recording the emotion of the song and the uh, the vibrancy of the lyrics so he was an obvious choice it's going to be focused entirely and sculpted and, and lit around his voice you know that makes it uh, an exciting prospect when you walk through a storm Do I feel nervous releasing my first solo album? Um, wouldn't it be the word I use? I think excited. It's just like a dream come true for me. You know, I, in a past life, was a, a, an investment banker and at 23 decided, you know, I want to be a professional singer and, and, and do this for a living. You know, a few years on, I'm actually doing it and now finally here's the solo album. Well I think the record's going to have a timeless quality, it's very orchestrated with some beautiful arrangements which gives it a real sense of classic feel without being stuck in a time frame so it will give the record longevity and particularly coupled with the, the, the song choice it gives it a wonderful sense of uh, elegance and sophistication. If I never sell one album, you know what? It's been an amazing experience. Uh, do I want to sell millions of albums? Absolutely. <laughs>